Chapter 1 The Joy of Handmade Crafts In a small town nestled among green meadows and rolling hills, there lived a young girl named Lily. Lily loved spending her afternoons engrossed in the world of handmade crafts. Whether it was knitting colorful scarves or painting intricate designs on wooden boxes, Lily had a knack for creating beautiful things with her own two hands. Lily's love for handmade crafts stemmed from a multitude of benefits it brought her. Firstly, she found that engaging in such activities allowed her creativity to soar. She could let her imagination run wild as she picked out vibrant yarns or selected brushes in different sizes. Through her crafts, Lily could bring to life the ideas that danced in her mind, turning them into unique pieces of art. More than just fostering creativity, Lily also found a deep sense of accomplishment in completing her handmade crafts. She would spend hours carefully stitching together pieces of fabric to create a cozy blanket, or delicately gluing beads onto a picture frame. Seeing the end result filled her heart with joy and pride. Each completed project acted as a reminder that she had the ability to transform simple materials into something extraordinary. Handmade crafts also acted as a therapeutic experience for Lily. Whenever she felt overwhelmed or stressed, she would sit down at her small wooden table and lose herself in the world of crafting. The rhythmic movements of her hands as she knitted or painted had a calming effect on her. The worries and troubles of the day melted away, leaving her feeling refreshed and at peace. One sunny afternoon, Lily's neighbor, Mrs. Thompson, noticed her engrossed in a new crafting project. Curiosity peaked. Mrs. Thompson approached Lily to see what she was working on. Lily happily showed her the intricate origami animals she was folding with colorful paper. You know, Lily, Mrs. Thompson said, a twinkle in her eye, handmade crafts have been around for centuries. People have been creating beautiful things with their hands since ancient times. Lily looked up, her interest peaked. Really, Mrs. Thompson? That's amazing. Yes, dear, Mrs. Thompson nodded. Not only do handmade crafts allow us to express our creativity and bring ideas to life, but they also have a rich history. In fact, many cultures around the world value and celebrate the art of crafting. Lily listened intently, her eyes widening in wonder. She realized then that handmade crafts were more than just a fun pastime, they were an important part of human history. As the sun set, Lily continued her crafting, now with a newfound appreciation for the tradition she was carrying on. With each fold, each stroke of the brush, she understood that she was not just creating something beautiful, but contributing to a long-standing legacy of creativity and craftsmanship. And so, Lily's love for handmade crafts continued to blossom, offering her endless joy and satisfaction. She knew that as long as she had her crafting supplies and her imagination, she would always find happiness in creating with her own two hands. Question, what are the benefits of engaging in handmade crafts? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 2, Exploring Different Handmade Crafts In this chapter, we will explore different types of handmade crafts that you can try at home. Handmade crafts are creations made by people using their hands and imagination. They are a great way to express your creativity and show your unique style. Let's dive in and learn about some popular types of handmade crafts. One popular type of handmade craft is knitting. Knitting involves using two lawn needles and yarn to create various items like scarves, hats, and sweaters. It requires patience and practice, but once you get the hang of it, knitting can be a lot of fun. You can choose different colors and patterns to make your knitted items unique and special. Another type of handmade craft is pottery. Pottery involves shaping clay into different forms like bowls, cups, and plates. You can use your hands or pottery tools to mold the clay into the desired shape. After shaping, the pottery needs to be baked in a kiln to harden. Once it's done, 
You can paint and decorate it with beautiful colors and glazes. Paper quilling is another fascinating handmade craft. It involves rolling thin strips of colorful paper and shaping them into different designs. You can create flowers, animals, or even make decorative patterns. It's a meticulous craft that requires attention to detail, but it can be an excellent way to relax and express your artistic side. Jewelry making is a popular form of handmade craft that allows you to create your own accessories. You can use beads, charms, and different types of threads to make necklaces, bracelets, and earrings. Not only can you design jewelry to match your outfits, but you can also gift them to your loved ones. Soap making is a creative and fun handmade craft that lets you customize your own soaps. You can mix different oils, scents, and colors to create unique combinations. Soap making can be both relaxing and practical as you can use the soaps you make yourself. Handmade crafts are a fantastic way to express your creativity and showcase your personality. They allow you to create something beautiful with your own hands. The best part is that there are endless possibilities when it comes to handmade crafts. You can experiment with different materials, techniques, and designs to make each creation special. So, why not try your hand at one of these handmade crafts? Whether it's knitting, pottery, paper quilling, jewelry making, or soap making, you're sure to find something that sparks your interest. Remember, the joy of handmade crafts comes from the process itself and the satisfaction of seeing your finished creation. So, let your imagination run wild and let your creativity soar as you explore these exciting handmade crafts. Question, what are some popular types of handmade crafts? Check the video description for the answer.